So in this question, first thing that I'll do is I'll find the domain of this question. So for domain, so first condition I'll write, two minus X should be greater than or equal to zero. That is X is less than or equal to two. Second condition I'll write is for this square root, which is one minus X should be greater than or equal to zero. And that is X should be less than or equal to one. And third condition, I'll write it for the square root, which is four minus under root of one minus X. So four minus under root of one minus X, this should be greater than or equal to zero. So under root of one minus X should be less than or equal to four. So if I'll square it, I'll get what? One minus X is less than or equal to 16. So X is greater than or equal to minus 15. So if I'll take all the three conditions together, I'll get X should be greater than or equal to minus 15, but less than or equal to one. So domain of this question is value of X should lie between minus 15 and one. Now I'll solve this question. So I'll take it on the right hand side. I'll write simply four minus under root of one minus X is greater than under root of two minus X. And then I can square both sides. If I'll square, I'll get four under root of one minus X is greater than two minus X. So I can actually write it as two plus X is greater than under root of one minus X. In this case, I have an irrational expression on the right hand side and a rational expression on the left hand side. So I need to take two separate cases. Case one, when X plus two is less than zero and case two, when X plus two is greater than or equal to zero. Now, when X plus two is less than zero, what I get is, what I'll get is, so when X plus two is greater than, sorry. Now when X plus two, now when X plus two is less than zero, what I'll get is left hand side, which is negative is greater than right hand side, which is positive. So in this case, I won't get a solution. So that means this condition, I won't get any result. Now when X plus two is greater than or equal to zero. So now I have two plus X, which is greater than one minus X. And both of them, they are positive. So I'll square it. If I'll square it, I'll get what? Four plus X square plus four X. And this is greater than one minus X. So I can simply write it as X square plus five X plus three, and it should be greater than zero. So now when I'll solve this condition, I'll get minus five plus minus root 13 by two. So I'll take a number line. I like both the solutions. So minus five minus under root 13 by two minus five plus and root 13 by two. So rightmost is plus, plus minus and plus. So either it is less than five minus root 13 by two, or it is greater than minus five plus root 13 by two. But then this result, it has come with the condition and the condition is X should be greater than or equal to minus two. The minus two will lie here, right? So this is minus two. So when I take the intersection of these two conditions, result I'll get is X should be greater than minus five plus under root 13 by two. So now I need to take intersection of this result and the domain. So I'll need to take intersection of these two conditions. So when I take the intersection of these two conditions, the result, the final result that I'll get is the value of X should be greater than minus five plus under root 13 by two, but less than or equal to one. So that is the answer to this question.